Hello, this is Eric at the Prince George Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2014 Ford F-150 in an XLT trim, powered by a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost engine, giving you plenty of power with great fuel efficiency, and coming with a deflector on the hood, running boards, heavy duty mud flaps on the front and rear tires, and uh, vent shades on the windows, and then finally a soft top tunnel cover on the back to keep your belongings nice and dry. You've got some excellent accessories on the outside, but let's take a look inside. Just before we look inside, I did actually forget these nice uh, chrome trim on the bottom, running along the bottom of the truck, but then looking in the back where you have spacious seating for three that does fold up and out of the way to accommodate any other cargo you want to put back here with plenty of space. And looking here in the center, you do have a 12 volt power outlet and fold out cup holders, so your back passengers are not without. Just to note, this vehicle does have a remote start installed as well, so no need to get outside on those cold mornings to start your car. And looking inside, you have power windows, power mirrors, and power locks, as well as a partially power adjustable driver's seat and comfortable cloth interior all around. And now sitting in the truck with it running, you can see that it's sitting at 109,851 kilometers. Moving down to the steering wheel, on the right-hand side, you have your hands-free phone and radio controls, and on the left-hand side, you have your cruise control buttons here and your controls for your center screen here where you can cycle through some gauges such as your transmission temperature compass and a blank screen and then your trip a and b so uh, distance driven time taken fuel consumed fuel economy truck app so your off-road and trailer and then settings for some of the features around your vehicle and whatnot and information such as warnings and other such things but then moving on to your center, your infotainment screen, which is radio, Sirius, CD, auxiliary, and Bluetooth, I believe. And, uh, yeah, I believe that is all, because this just goes to the auxiliary. But moving on from that, it is also your backup camera screen, which has a rear sensor, I believe, which will alert you if you're about to hit something, so, um, I mean... You can hopefully avoid any collisions. You can also zoom in on where your hitch would be if you're trying to connect something like a trailer. You can have an easier time there. But then moving down from that, you have your physical media and climate controls. Pretty simple, easy to use. To the left of that, you have your 4x4 controls and towing controls, or trailer controls. And to the right of that, you have a 12-volt power outlet with a small cubby underneath. And then here you have this compartment, which opens to reveal your auxiliary USB and a 12 volt power outlet once again, as well as some storage, so you can maybe uh, charge your device in there. Up to you, but then moving on to your center here, where you have two cup holders, a cubby, and your center compartment slash armrest here, which is pretty spacious, but then this does fold up and out of the way to become your fifth passenger seat and sixth seat overall, so plenty of seating and space in this truck. But then underneath that, you do also have another compartment, which is also pretty spacious. And then, well, the seat doesn't even have to be up to pull these out, but you have two more cup holders hidden right there, which is pretty nice. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111, or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself, and have a nice day.